conversations Talking to myself like why you waiting I don't pay no mind what they be saying Cause I want greatness I tell the way go if you hate it I got no patience for all of these other conversations If you ain't talking money we don't say shit They used to tell me why I'll never make it all this effort took was dedication So now the only thing that they can say to me is congratulations Why are they trying to bring Superman down? He want to save you Did the things that you would and now I do what you can do This the reason you alone now This the reason I left home now Can't have no one trying to slow down That's why I feel these blessings coming down I'm stressed when you're around Just when things go a little low It's like you can't be found Everyone talks, but no one listens. They want change, but don't do a different. Shut your mouth, stick to the vision. I'm so sick of hearing all these conversations. Talking to myself like, why you waiting? I don't pay no mind what they be saying. Cause I want greatness. I sell the way, go if you hating. I got no patience for all of these other conversations. If you ain't talking money, we don't say shit. They used to tell me why I'll never make it All this effort took nah, was dedication nah, So now yeah. the only thing hey. that they can say yeah. to me is congratulations <laughs> Congratulations, you done finally made a couple dollars, motherfucker, you the shit Now we been moving at the speed of light, trying to reach a dream that I could barely even see They don't believe I took the time to explain my side of the story Giving them all, but it's never reciprocated Everything's original, so I couldn't be duplicated About to take a vigor and laugh, I'm feeling vindicated They repeat the same shit like they syndicated Of course, a couple years ago, I couldn't pay for a place And pacing inside of a basement, basically calling it quits The conversation with myself was that I felt like shit My confidence was non-existent, opinions were carried away They told me I would never get this far, so in the town Instead, I buckled down and blocked it out to make it happen Only took a little self-belief to grasp what I imagined Conversations Talking to myself like why you waiting I don't pay no mind what they be saying Cause I want greatness I sell the way go if you hating I got no patience for all of these other conversations If you ain't talking money we don't say shit They used to tell me why I'll never make it all this ever took was dedication So now the only thing that they can say to me is congratulations Came here to get this money straight. Shorty wanna fornicate. That's why she tryna congregate. Stare me up and down the chest. She wanna lick me through the rap. Tryna see what's good with that. Cause honestly, that ass is fat. It's round and fat. I'm down with that. Down to stack, down to smash. Find a place to crush me. We got lucky at the laundry mat. Ladies folding clothes and shit. Mad decent exposure in. Old people recording us. Knock it down like a bowling pin. What about all the blow shit? What about all the clothes you wear? What if you roll this dick because you know I smell that doja here? Pass that shit right over here. She just hold it over time. Bend it like a folding chair. Put that thing in the overdrive. Uh, I need no pay. I just smash it out. I get hold out of cash it out. My niggas try to smash it. Like we smack it. Why? Hey, you know the extra. Why? Go pop it out. But you know what time it is. No lady down the ride. She fits. Bang, bang. What a cash, nigga. It's a chain bling, bang. Run past you, nigga. She said, damn, motherfucker. On my zipper, she licky like a lizard, getting stizzard, going timber. I hardly even remember. I'm with Reavers, don't believe us. We overseas, we feeling medieval, making a scene, creating a sequel, telling you we are not regular people, no. Doing it for the people, though. Doing this here for each of us. Everyone live your dream and such, and right now turn your speakers up. Listen to all the flows I spit. What about all the clothes you wear? What if you roll this bit because you know I smell that doja here? Pass that shit right over here. She just hold it over time. Bend it like a folding chair. Put that thing in the overdrive. Yeah, but like Michelle as well, Mini Fox, and um, uh, like Crow Eagle, and uh, Granite if he wants, um, Rick, there are so many Dutchies here, Amber of course, I would love to have a meet up with all of you guys, what, you all meet at the nearest windmill, yeah but there are so many dude, <laughs> You have tooth pain since your operation on the 26th of May. Holy shit. 
Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Wes. To go to Utrecht or something because it's most central for everybody. That's what I was thinking as well. But yeah, I, I, I'm not very familiar in Utrecht, so I don't really know what kind of um, possibilities there are there, you know. What are these green things with blinking lights? Uh, oh yeah, those? there's the two of the delays I set up earlier. Two of the what? Lasers? Uh, no, it's, it's two delay, uh, delay sensors. Oh, nice. If you would take that loose Let's see how long it takes him to course, notice me. It would go on and off. Is he going to sneeze? Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, we will try to fire off some uh, fireworks on this uh, platform. Oh. Oh. Dude, <clears throat> this fly is getting so much on my nerves. Just die or go away. I'm watching Thurston for a second before we play Prison Architect. Let's see how long it takes him to notice me. Molen, the stair in Utrecht. Lord Too Dark, what? Oh, he totally just Hey, Raptor, say oh, hello to my live stream, Thurston. Hi, live stream of Raptor. How are you doing, guys? I'm good. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm doing good. I'm going good here. Oh, that's good. We are going to blow up a planet, Raptor. We are literally going to blow up a planet or we're going to die trying. We have uh, that's pretty exciting. Well, I don't know. I don't know how it works if there's literally no land around anymore and just a course. I don't know if we just... Okay, we're going to play Prison Architect now. I just wanted to check in on Thurston. I usually, like, am too busy to say hi to my friends, so I, I got I to gotta say hi, otherwise I, f I feel lonely. Plus, Thurston des deserves some love. If you want to know Thurston's channel, by the way, that's a guy I stream with quite often, uh, I'll go ahead and drop a link for his channel. In the chat, you can go watch his live stream right now and uh, go sub to him and you can come back here right now. Uh, okay, let's play. I don't know where the hell these Discord notifications are coming from today. What is going on? There we go. Okay, let's play some Prison Architect. I like this game a lot. We are going, we're going to prison, guys. Yay! We're going to jail. Congratulations, chat. You're going to YouTuber jail. You never played Astroneer? That game is so good. So many people... Um, Whenever I go live with Astroneer, they don't watch, and it's like, oh my god, dude, that game is so cool. It's like, it's like a little bit of everything. It's like a little Lego, a little Space Engineers, a little, uh, feels a little like Minecraft. And the voxel system of mining in that game is really fun. Like, when you dig holes and stuff, you, you can make some big old holes. That game is cool. Big base building, it's all good stuff. Uh, I'm trying to get my live stream to work, but it won't work. Hmm. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. All right, cool. All right, thank you guys for becoming Raptor Eggs. Don Mahoney, thanks for the four. And Mark Perry coming on back as a Raptor Hatchling. Awesome. Thank you guys for clicking and tapping join and becoming members, by the way. Appreciate all that support. We'll be doing uh, some member streams here in a couple of days for more stuff. We'll figure out more games that we want to play. It'll be cool. Scott Bennett, thanks for the five. You're buying new headphones for PC and PS4 tomorrow morning. All right. Well, I'm getting myself a new mic soon, so that should be pretty cool. Now, uh, let's continue. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Good morning and welcome to another day in prison. Reminder, prison is not responsible for lost or stolen items, death or dismemberment. Heathcote Far- oh wait, what, what's the name? Heathcote- oh wait. Heathcote Heathcote fam, thanks for clicking the tab and joining me, becoming a raptor egg. Welcome to prison, and good to have you here yet again. Thanks for watching. Heathcote fam, thanks for clicking the tab and joining me, becoming a raptor egg. Welcome to prison, and good to have you here yet again. Thanks for watching. Yep, pretty damn good, uh, pretty good game. I love that, favorite feature. Alright, a couple things were broken we noticed last time. One, uh, whoever's supposed to be making medicines not making medicine. And two, I cannot believe the amount of stuff in this prison that will become dirty and people won't clean it. Like, we've got tons of cleaning staff, literally tons. We got tons of cleaning staff, yet they won't, they won't clean. 
even if they're higher upgrades. Like, look at all this cleaning staff. All these people here in blue, in these blue uniforms, are all cleaning staff. Like, we have more cleaners than anything else. I didn't know a prison got this dirty. Well, I have the best content. I've always, oh, I've always been your fave. Oh, Chad. And now, come on. Oh, if we earn 50,000 gold, we get another 2,000 gold? Wait, where did I get all this money from? Everything is completely filthy. The problem with things being filthy is that we can't use... I think we can put two... Can't we put, like, two thingies in one cell? Oh, it's, I guess it's too small. That's all right. We got more stuff going on now. I cannot believe how dirt... Come on, man. Go clean stuff. Even even with, um... Like, even doors get dirty. Like, how does a door get dirty like this? Like, is this rusted out? The prison's been here for, like, less than a year. Imagine, like, installing a door at your house and, like, your garage door just within a matter of, like, two months just goes completely... Just completely dirty. Bum, bum, ba, bum, ba, bum. Uh. Attention, staff. A new prisoner has arrived. Oh, yeah. Welcome to prison. Great to have you here. And welcome to Hell in the Cell, baby. <laughs> Oh, that guy's got a lot of disorders. Let's get him into uh, reading therapy first for the anger. And we have another new prisoner. Welcome to prison. And let's see where we can put you right there. And your disorder is also anger. There we go. Bum, bum. Rusty doors because the prisoners are peeing on it. Look, chat, not everything gets rusty just because you pee on it, okay? Some some people in chat are peons. Look at this break room. It's absolutely bustling with staff and everything's absolutely filthy. Like, I don't... I think at a certain point we're actually going to go bankrupt because if I hire so much staff, we're, n we're never going to make enough money to actually, like... Dude, why does everything take so long to be cleaned? This is a problem. Everything is just absolutely disgusting in this prison. Like, we're gonna have to have 25 cleaning staff to each prisoner. Yeah, I don't know why we can't make the prisoners do the cleaning. That'd be a good job for them to do, though. But they're actually here just to be rehabilitated, so it's not like we can give them jobs in, like, the kit. You'd think we could give them, like, jobs in the kitchen and, um, stuff like that, but I'm just gonna have to hire new maintenance personnel. I'm just going to put everybody in a room where something's oh, dirty yes. and hope that they clean it. Hello. I can't believe the amount of, like, dirtiness. Oh, yes. Hi. Oh, ho. Hi. When oh, stuff's dirty, hi. it stops functioning, and when it stops functioning, then nobody gets rehab. So it, it becomes a problem. Uh, hello, Raptor. Former Egg here saying hello. Oh, well, thank you for your support. That's nice. Yeah, I'm glad. Yeah, you guys, you know, if, if you become a member for a month because you want to and then cancel it or something, that's totally fine. Don't ever think like I'm mad or that I know about it or that secretly I'm judging you. I don't even know. Like, it, YouTube gives me a list of who's a member, but, like, to look at it, it would just be like a huge list of names. It doesn't tell me if somebody ends their membership or anything like that, which is cool. Like, it shouldn't be something I should be mad about. You support because you want to. Manual labor such as cleaning is a good form of therapy. That's true. Well, it's kind of more like a good use of their time. It would be nice, though, if like if you get the prisoners rehabilitated to give them the ability to do something before their parole. Because like once, once you've rehabilitated them, you get money for the rehabilitation, but then they just kind of sit in the prison for a while before they're released. So it would be nice to like maybe um, give them some sort of job or something in the prison beforehand. Before they leave. Like, rehabil rehabilitate them of their disorders and then give them skills so that way they can, like, become uh, productive members of society. Look at all the cleaning going on here. What, what are you doing, ma'am? Go, go clean this. Like she's cleaning the poster. I can't believe everything in this game has to be, like, dusted down. They need, they need to work on that because that's just, like, infuriating. 
Like, it makes sense that a bed would get dirty or that a shower or a toilet would need to be cleaned, but it's like in The Sims. Like, if something's not used, it shouldn't be, like... Like, obviously, in The Sims, you have to clean, I don't know, your countertop and your plates more than you have to clean, like, your sofa or, like, the picture on the wall. Oh, well. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, it would be cool to be able to get your prisoners to go out of the prison, too, to do, like, off-site parole stuff. Like, uh, sending people out to go do, um, I don't know, chain gang stuff or whatever, like road maintenance. Okay, they also want us to get a basketball court, and they want us to earn $50,000. We're close to that. We're pretty close. Oh. Attention, staff. A new prisoner has arrived. Welcome to prison. Great to have you here. And welcome to Hell in the Cell, baby. <laughs> Wow, we're still waiting for the TV to be cleaned. We're gonna have to make another break room. There's like 80 people in one room. You know, it'd be cool uh, to play a shipbuilding game in this style, like a spaceship builder or a space station builder. That'd be cool. Be able to build a station to accommodate people. Always, always welcome those games. Alcoholic disorder. Okay, he needs art. Do we have a jail cell? Uh, all right, here we go. Oh. And we'll put you in that therapy. There we go. Bum, 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 bum. What about a pirate ship builder? Oh, that'd be cool too. Although I'm thinking of it in terms of like a lot of little rooms. I guess uh, Space Haven. That, that spaceship builder game is pretty similar to that, where you can, like, uh, you build a hull to your ship, and then you fill the spaces with all sorts of, like, um, you know, like a scanning room, or like a, like a, I don't know, a shuttle room, or like a refinery, that kind of thing. Okay. Oh, we got a pretty decent prison going, but we need to we need to add more time to this. Yeah, this seems fine. Space prison? Oh, okay. See, that would be cool. To actually have, like, a space prison ship? That'd be interesting. There's a lot of games that are kind of similar to all of what I said. I want there to be more, though. I don't think we can have enough games, you know? Yeah, so this Prison Tycoon game has been around for years, like since 2005. The Prison uh, Architects, uh, the Prison Tycoon series has been around. Prison Architects newer, and kind of more in the style like RimWorld and stuff. But this is kind of like their fourth game. It's been around well, a while. That's it, folks. Another day wrapped up nicely in prison. It's been great to have you here. Enjoy your sleep, and we'll see you tomorrow morning. <laughs> they need to. Uh, Prison, prison staff, all these cleaners and stuff, need to prioritize the um, the stuff that's the dirtiest. They need to work their way up and down. How close are we to Prestige 5? Prestige 5 is at 1, 125,000. Okay. We're not even halfway there. Could add some more lighting. What inspired me to become a YouTuber? I just enjoyed playing some multiplayer games and would put up uh, video footage of me playing certain games. And then it eventually became fun to attract more people to come play games with me, and then eventually I found out I was mediocre at YouTube, so I was like, okay. I don't want to become good or anything. Just mediocre. What? A thousand dollars for a light? Are you kidding me? That's how expensive these lights are? Wow. That's ridiculous. Does it increase the prestige of the prison a lot, though? What's the benefit of that? 112? Pfft, that's nothing. I could put in windows. 
Wait, how do I uh, put windows in? 90 prestige for a 450 window. Wow. This does really make me think of uh, Prison Architect, I mean, uh, Two Point Hospital, and I like that a lot. Okay, let's just keep pumping windows in. Hey, what's up, uh, Enzuna? How you doing? Hey, okay, that looks good. I don't know if that does anything to increase our... I don't know if that does anything else other than prestige. It'd be kind of nice if it, like, increased, I don't know, prisoner happiness or something? You'd think it'd be crazy to put windows in a prison, and you're right, except there's, like, a... There's a fence with barbed wire, and then another concrete fence with barbed wire, too, a giant wall. Yeah, the lighting in the game is cool, too. Just... The, the cleaning system has, like, completely... its It just seems broken. There's so many, um... Again, it, it, it's an early access game, so I guess they could just easily get a lot of feedback from testing it out and people watching and doing the math. I hope it gets a little better. Look, look at this. Ar army of cleaners leaving. Look at this. Every one of these people in a blue shirt is here to clean. They've actually clogged the exit now. Look at the, just the absolute army of cars leaving the prison. I've had to hire like 60 people just to clean, and they're not even done yet, by the way. There's still stuff that they weren't able to clean. Is there a way for me to have two shifts of like daytime and nighttime cleaners? I don't know if... I know I can do like a work schedule for hours, but I don't know if I can like break it into two shifts. Morning cell, opening hours, meal times, lockdown hours, visiting hours, sport hours, leisure, library therapy. No, I, I don't think I can do that. Can I adjust the prison hours? Uh, parole evaluation. Oh, boy. Oh, his addiction... He's not even done with his gambling addiction. That's denied. Okay. Not even everyone got to leave the prison. It took them, like, an entire month to leave the prison. Oh, and now they're back. Look, there was a line in front of the door. Not everyone even got to leave. That That's, that's a serious issue. I have to hire so many staff just to clean all the items. But you need items for prestige. It's like every item that you put in your prison creates prestige, but everything has to be cleaned. Everything. Posters have to be cleaned. Potted plants have to be cleaned. Not only when you buy a trash can, not only do they have to like empty the trash, but they also have to clean the trash can itself. And if something's not clean, then it has to be like it shuts down. Like who gets a desk this dirty? Like, how? What happened? Like, did you just put a firecracker in a bag of garbage and just let it blow? Wow. I can make more garage entrances to help them, the staff get out. Oh, that's true. But I guess I don't really care if they leave or not because they just turn right back around. And Like, them leaving and coming to the prison is just an animation. So it's like... Oh, of course. Uh, let's see. Rehab 15 prisoners, grant 15 paroles, and build a basketball court. Well, basketball court seems cool. We're going to leave this area here for uh, parole, though. Or for therapy, so we can get people out on parole. Yeah, like, I need this stuff to be cleaned. Like, what's this guy doing? 
He's a maintenance man. He just walked around and then left. And walks around. Like, let's follow one of our staff members. This guy's supposed to be cleaning. Dude, clean it. Stun, stun, stun lock, stun lock, stun lock, stun, stun locked. Oh, there we go. Good morning and welcome to another day in prison. My prison is not responsible for lost or stolen items, death or dismemberment. <sighs> How do you clean a hologram? I don't know, but it has to be dusted down. <laughs> Yes, this hologram has to be, uh, dusted. Okay. Well, we're making good money. Let's add another, uh, painting thing here so we can get multiple... I think this is for alcoholism, so it'd probably be good to have more than one. I think we have a couple people with that disorder. There we go. Yeah, no, the game has lots of potential, and I love it, despite all the issues. It just makes it funny. Because then a whoa wah will come in and be like, I hired a billion staff members, and then whoa wah wah whoa, 12 minute whoa wah. You know. Increase watch time through constant distractions from clicking away. <laughs> no actual substance or content, just packaging. Whoa. <laughs> the question is not how to clean the hologram, the question is how did it get dirty? That's a good question. That's a big brain question. Wait, these guys have compulsive gambling disorders. Why are they here? Alright, let's get you over here, sir. Sign you to this therapy. Yep, prisoners can try to escape. You might see that if you keep on watching. Hello, chat. Hello, grandpa. Alright, how dare you. Security. How dare you. Wow. Personal attack. Attention staff, a new prisoner has arrived. Oh good. Welcome to prison. Excellent. Great to have you here. And welcome to hell in the cell, baby. Yeah, now you're in jail for that comment, aren't you? That's right. Good, somebody's been uh, rehabilitated. Alright, what's your condition? Anger. Okay, so that means books. Ooh, we're rehabilitating quite a few people. Unfortunately, this hologram needs a bigger office. We, we could probably end up moving this. Yeah, all the guys in the uh, room there are cardboard cutouts. Kind of funny. I think we need to make a new room. I think I have to make a separate room now for therapy. We'll have to do a separate one for, like, uh, VR. Wait, required size is 80 by 80. Wait, I can't just make a small room? Wait, 80 by 80? Oh, that was for editing. Uh-oh. Everybody got kicked out of jail. Let's create a building. There we go. There we go. Okay, we'll make this for extended uh, therapy rooms. We don't, we don't really have any space for, like, a yard or anything. It's got to be all prison. 
I need all this real estate. Oh no, now they're gonna have to clean this, aren't they? Maybe I shouldn't have built that yet, but that's okay. Everyone got tossed out. All right, we'll do some more, uh, what is this? Jurassic Pack. All right, we'll do some more of this VR stuff up here. I need some more treatments for that. Therapy room, virtual reality therapy. We'll just do like a couple of one rooms. Oh, we don't have enough money. There we go. All right, we're gonna need a lot more people in that room. Try to get everyone uh, organized and spread out a little bit. Low stamina, okay. You guys need more books? Ooh, we have a... Uh, okay, we need to add some more reading areas. Yeah, that'll speed that up. Bum, bum. Yeah, we can make the uh, VR room bigger, but if I do that, I can't assign more therapists to it. Plus, we're going to have to move it anyway. Yeah, we're going to do a court down here soon. Well, we're going to need some money, though. I guess the problem is the bigger... Um, well, regardless, having more stuff just means more things have to be cleaned. Looks like they're actually managing to keep things clean now. Kind of. How many staff do I just have for cleaning? Like, look at that. That's ridiculous. It looks like a new prisoner's on the way. TV needs to be cleaned. I wonder if this is based on how often it's used or... Must be. Although I think the uh, TV is actually just kind of a prestige element. I don't think when they sit in the chair that it actually does that. Bum, 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 bum. Well, staff eventually have to leave a room, so if they do, then uh, the room kind of shuts down. It's a good idea to have multiple staff. Though I don't know if you can make them work in shifts. Because, like, if I try to put another desk in this room, I don't think we can do that. Yeah, you can only have one therapist assigned to a room. I don't know. Attention, staff. A new prisoner has arrived. Welcome to prison. Welcome to prison. Yeah, we got about 20 prisoners or so right now. Wow, how could there be trash when there's not even people coming into this room? It's so annoying how, like, trash just ends up on the floor and nobody's actually, like, going there. Yeah, you can promote staff, but I've noticed even with promoted uh, maintenance staff, it, it increases the rate in which they can clean, but they go on break then, and then, there's, then they're all just in here. So it's like, you need... There needs to be a way to do multiple shifts. Like, look at all the maintenance staff in here not even cleaning. You love the channel? Thanks for the support. Appreciate that. Oh, we made some good money, though. Power's coming in, lots of water and food. At least we don't have to worry about that. It should be just pure profits, with only expenses being when we build a... Uh, we actually build like a structure. Yeah, 
Nice. Good sound effects. Alright, we'll wait a little bit and see if we can get some more cash for more buildings. More rooms. We definitely need another break room. I think when people... Yeah, when the couch and the check mark is above their head, it means that they're resting. So if they're... If they're in this room, they're doing okay. You think the janitors are making things dirty? It's part of a conspiracy? Oh, yeah. Making more work? They got their jobs guaranteed, for sure. Yeah, maintenance, the only thing they actually do is clean. I guess that's also like a... Ca so, uh, there could be, I guess, like in Park in park Attack or in Planet Coast, you have like maintenance and you have like cleaning. But this combines them both into just maintenance. So there's not like engineers or anything. So they both do like two-in-one deals. So basically it's like, if something becomes dirty, you could also consider that it becomes... Uh, like that it's broken and needs repair. Uh, what's the name of the prison? Uh, the algorithm. They, they, they don't want you going anywhere. They don't want you to go. I can't believe there's just trash. Like, every single uh, square block of the prison just becomes, like, dirty. I can't believe it. Yeah, we're going to need more cells. Well, actually, we got parole coming up here shortly. Actually, we have parole now. So we could send some people out on parole. But now we have some early releases, so now we got some more prison space. Can you download a demo of Gates of Hell? Um, you'll have to check Steam. They had a demo, but I... They had a beta, but I don't know if it's still available. However, for members, we will be doing more giveaways of Gates of Hell. So if anybody is uh, interested in that, or if you become a member, we have all sorts of giveaways. Recently, I did some more giveaways of um, the Rift Breaker, which is a fantastic uh, little prologue game. And I think we, had, we gave away keys for the full game when that comes out soon. It'll be later this fall. Okay, well now we have $25,000, so that's good. So we're gonna have to figure out what other... Uh, I think what we're gonna have to do is from here on out, we're just gonna go through every new prisoner and find out like what, what each one needs. $15 gives huge, thank you very much. Attention staff, a new prisoner has arrived. Welcome to prison, great to have you here. And welcome to Hell in the Cell, baby. <laughs> Algotraz, yeah. Pilot Pro and Baltimore's are like the best comedic people in our community. They have like... They need to write jokes for me. Like I need to do a monologue like I'm Jay Leno or something. Okay, this person has a alcoholic disorder, so that means more uh, painting. Wait, is that... Was that an empty cell? I think so. Uh, that was a demo star. So most games that I played in the last month have all been just demos during Steam's big demo event, which was pretty cool. I always like taking a look at demos too, because it really lets you get a feel for a game. But for a game like this, I like this enough to where I just want to keep on playing it. I want to do another prison set. I mean, another therapy room here, and we need we. There's another one space here for a another two by one, but I don't know what we can put there. 
bum 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 Have I heard of Feudal Baron? You play as some medieval rich middleman? Oh no, I, I don't think I've heard of that. If you guys have game suggestions for me, I'm gonna forget in the chat, so don't 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 tell me about games here. Go to the Discord and you can like DM me there. Or just chat about it in the general chat too. Always good for game suggestions, especially now because Steam Summer Sale is coming to an end. You got like two days to add a bunch of games to your wish list. Definitely, definitely make sure that you go to uh, Steam and pick up DLCs like American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck have been amazing. Good stuff. Uh, this game doesn't have maximum or minimum security. Uh, everybody just goes into a regular jail cell, and then if uh, they happen to uh, get rowdy or violent in prison, you can send them to an isolation cell, but I haven't had that happen just yet. But this game's not complete, so they might, they might add some things like that in the future. I guess we could put a sidewalk all the way around the prison now. Well, that's it, folks. Another day wrapped up nicely in prison. It's been great to have you here. Enjoy your sleep, and we'll see you tomorrow morning. It's funny how I address the prisoners like how I address chat at the end of every live stream. Yeah, the game uh, classifies their disorders as disorders. So if somebody's here for alcoholism or... Or let's say that they have alcoholism and... Um, uh, maybe kleptomania, then there's two different spots that they'll have to go to. So it's under disorders. The goal is to house them and then rehabilitate them for money. ba bum 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 Yeah, exactly, Tan. Exactly. Well, I want to add some more lights to the prison to make it look nice. I wish there were more lighting options. You know what would be cool in this game is research. It'd be cool if we had a research department. see anything for that yet though amazing how dark it gets inside the prison I can't believe there's not, there's not like ceiling lights or anything. It's all when you make a building, it's it's just like really building a wall. Like the prison's still outdoors. But this will raise our prestige and our energy consumption. Wow, we're actually burning through energy now. Energy consumption will stop once daytime comes. We also need to buy the territory to the south so we can do a out. Uh, we're going to do a yard for like outdoor activities. Plenty of room for activities. Boom. Ooh, we can buy it for 30,000. Wow, look at how large we can make the. Uh... Wow, we can make the prison really big. Cool. Oh, there goes our cavalcade. Look at the army just leaving. Oh, 
how much are these things? Uh, what would that be under? Uh, outdoor? Oh yeah, there it is. Parking entrance, 7,500. Ooh, you get 750 prestige for it. Okay. Doesn't really do anything, though, because, like, watch. Look at all these people in line. The start of the next day, they'll just turn right back around and go to work. There's no going home. There's no leaving. But it raises that prestige. All right, more prisoners for parole. Sure. Sure. Bum, bum, bum. Can the prisoners have jobs? Well, once they leave, I suppose. But yeah, it doesn't look like a way for the prison to make money by outsourcing them or anything. Oh, actually, we can move this thing, can't we? Can we put this anywhere? Oh, we can put the parking garage entrance anywhere. I wonder, does that mean I can put both of them over here? Okay, that one can't be moved. Okay, yeah, so we'll put one there. All right. Oh, somebody reoffended. Damn. Always a dice roll with those guys. Need to put a power utility area here. That stuff out of the way. What, we could do a windmill? Dutch breathing intensifies. Wow, brings 1250, ooh. Oh, it's, oh, hello. Hold on just a second. Bro. Nice. Oh, and we got a bigger water tank, too. Yes, you did, Booster. You did hear windmills. Can you build the windmill in Prison, Ar Ar uh, prison Tycoon? Yes, you can. Confirmed. Confirmed. Okay, let's sell this thing. And let's connect these two. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, it doesn't rotate? Good what? Good morning and welcome to another day in prison. Reminder, prison is not responsible for lost or stolen items, death or dismemberment. Bzzz. Okay. No new prisoners just yet. Ooh, somebody's uh, being released. Good. Most of our prisoners are now rehabilitated. And most of them look like they're assigned to where they need to go too. Reading therapy for the anger. What do we got for new grants? Build a game room, build arcade machines, build a basketball court. We still got to do that. Let's build a basketball court over by the power thing. That's got to be an outdoor item. 
Uh, gym. Place for... Uh... Place of worship for fitness enthusiasts. Prisoners will come here to work and play sports. Okay, well that's what we need then. And we need a lot of money for that, so we gotta wait. My local police station used to give people they locked up McDonald's. Wow. It must have been an increase in crime then. All right, so now we just chill for a while and wait for more prisoners to come in, make some more cash. Then we'll build ourselves a, a yard there. I guess we'll just kind of wait. Look at every cell just being, like, clean, dude. This is like a ho I mean, this is like housekeeping. Most people... I, I wonder what the average stay of a, a person at a hotel is. Maybe a couple days for business. Attention, staff. A new prisoner has arrived. Welcome to prison. Great to have you here. And welcome to hell in the cell, baby. Uh, okay, let's make a outdoor. So is it six thousand per block? Minimum is twelve by twelve. Wait, really? Well, I guess we can always add, um, I guess we can always add space to it. What's up, bro? Where's Pinto Bless time? Uh, Pinto Bless time could be any time. It's all, it all depends on when chat, when all chat decides. Oh, we gotta put a water fountain in there, too? Oh, I, I have four dollars left. Uh-oh. That means I could click or tap join and become a member four times to get access to all sorts of different perks and such, including the Pinto Bless emote. I think we should re-record some of our uh, welcomes. Let's re-redo re -redo all of these. We will re-redo them all. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Good. Hello, good morning, wake up, sleepyheads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. Hello, good morning, wake up, sleepyheads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. Dude, I hate your prison? Oh, that's right. I like it. Hello! Wait, no. Uh, lockdown at night. Okay, bedtime everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. Okay, bedtime everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. Cool. Uh, someone's trying to escape. That is totally not cool, and I bet the prison guard is definitely going to stop short of... Oh, yep, look at that. The prison guard stopped chasing them. Imagine that. Uh, someone's trying to escape. That is totally not cool, and I bet the prison guard is definitely going to stop short of... Oh, yep, look at that. The prison guard stopped chasing him. Imagine that. There you go. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, we need more money before we can finish the yard. Also, the yard seems very small. No, it's, it's more just like a... I figured it was going to be a big outdoor area, but I guess not. Oh, well. Bum, 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 bum. 
bum 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 Yep, we just need to wait for some cash to come in now from rehab. Yeah, we have a lot of water though, that's good. Glad I spent Oh, the windmill doesn't turn though. Very upsetting. It is making power though. things going oh we got a new prisoner I forgot all about our new prisoner well let's get you into jail and we need to give you oh, let's put you into painting there we go two new prisoners now and when we rehab 15 of them we get 2,000 bucks so that's good free money and your disorder is sociopath and anger there we go oh look we have a heart pyramid good job first try too gotta be chat's goal when you see someone going for a pyramid you gotta cut them off non-members you gotta put some ones in chat Ooh, we're almost up to 300 likes whoa all right thank you guys for that top tier support greatly appreciate that can we put down the drinking fountain now oh we can knowing the prisoners they're gonna go in there like crazy Oh, okay, so now we can put a basketball hoop in the corner. So we just need more... We need more money. Just need more money. Uh, are there just male prisoners or also female? Oh, they can be whatever they want. When they grow up and go back home... They can be whatever they want when they're rehabilitated. Well, the good news is we have plenty of resources. Food looks like it's getting a little low, though. We have, like... Don't we have, like, four full-time chefs? Oh, yeah, some of them are on break. All right, food might be the next thing to worry about. We should be able to parole some prisoners soon. Won't be too long. Oh, another prisoner. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. All right, new prisoner has... Wow, a lot of anger disorder. A lot of people mad. Definitely gonna have to build some more chairs and stuff for everybody. Bum, 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 bum. Ah, we can easily just make another uh, break room for all of our staff. If we put a few break rooms around the prison, that'll minimize the distance a lot of people have to walk. So once we add another one like over here and maybe one down here, there'll be plenty of rooms for everybody to go to break. Especially for the maintenance staff because they got to go from like one section of the prison to the other since they're doing maintenance. Okay, bed 
time, everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. <laughs> Lol. I don't think there's uh, canine kennels or anything in this game. Wow, look at all the... Everybody just goes on break when they're tired. Looks like they're waiting for a bus. Well, we'll get more money at the end of the day. Oh, there they go. There we go. Oh, we just had to pay all of our staff. Oof. That's right, we'll get some money this morning. Bum, 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 bum. All right, Lars is good. All right, let's put that basketball court in. We should be able to paint the ground under this yard, too. I guess we'll just make it all pavement. There we go. There we go. Perfect. All right, here comes all of our staff again. It's funny, when the prisoners are released, they just, like, go to the parking garage. They should leave through the front gate and, um, like, get on a car or something. Welcome to prison. Yeah, I think we need some more reading chairs here. A lot of people are in here for anger disorder. Some more to our prestige worldwide. There we go. Would I ever do custom phone messages? Uh, are those a thing anymore? Like voicemail? I guess I, I guess I could. I'd like to do voice acting in a game, but. And I, I got a lot on my plate. I have some stuff to do, but... I don't know if I could ever do a triple-A game. It'd be cool to be in, like, a Grand Theft Auto game once or something. Who knows? Maybe one day if my grades are good enough.
Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Oh yeah, we're supposed to make a game room, aren't we, for uh, prisoners to go and like play video games and stuff, I guess. Uh, let's make a room. Oops. Okay, let's make a game room in here. We could put another staff break room down here, too. Yeah, we gotta buy him, like, two arcade machines. That was, like, a, one of our quests. Oh, what other grants are there? Um, prestige, prestige level five. Everything else is prisoner related. Promote five guards. Promote five medics. Promotions. Here's oh, and this one's glitched. The uh, 150 medical supplies is definitely glitched. Place five posters. Two out of five. Okay, let's see if there's more posters. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Yeah. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying quite me sometime. Cool. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, we got a new prisoner. We'll check on them shortly. All right, the, the cleaning thing seems to be under control now, for the most part. There's still some things that I think are just stun-locked. Like, this TV has never been cleaned. Or it's so popular that it just immediately is dirty again. We should probably do like another bigger staff room then. Let's make a door here. And I'm gonna make a bigger staff room. this room? I guess we should. But it, get, it, it just makes more things for them to clean. Now it looks like a waiting room. TVs in here. Well, the more we decorate, too, it'll raise our prestige. Hopefully that bigger room makes sure everybody's got a seat, but uh, we'll see. Everybody seems to go on break at the same time. All the maintenance staff get right to work and they get tired at the same time. Uh, someone's trying to escape. That is totally not cool, and I bet the prison guard is definitely going to stop short of... Oh, yep, yeah, look at that. The prison guard stopped chasing us. Imagine that. <laughs> they actually caught him this time. Oh, we need to take him alone. Okay, well, we'll wait for a little bit. 
All right. Well, things are making some improvements. Now, what are the what happens if the prisoners come here to play basketball? Is this like give them something to do and that's it, or what? Is this any sort of therapy? Allows them to play a sport. What does that do, though? I mean, it gave us $3,000 to make a $2,000 basketball hoop, so we earned $1,000. I guess our goal now is just to rehab, like, tons of prisoners with each ailment. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got that new guy. Uh, let's see. Anger, kleptomania. Okay. Well, let's get you into reading therapy. Make a little prisoner library there. Yeah, even when these rooms have garbage cans, they just... Like, there's literally trash next to a garbage can, like, right here. I wish they would put more trash in garbage cans. Alright, well, we'll wait for more money. Got no problem spending it. Boom, boom, boom. Harry Pog. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Harry Pog. Okay, what do we got? Oh, Al alcohol. That's um, painting. No, don't go clean the deck. Clean this. Man, there's like nobody prioritizes in this prison. Imagine if these people were firefighters. Like, we got a cat in a tree and we've got a nuclear power plant on facility. Oh boy, better get the ladder for Fluffles. We don't want him to be a little scared in the tree. seeing, uh, I was just reading some stuff on Twitter just quick. YouTube. <laughs> Interestingly enough, speaking of prisons and such, it seems like YouTube's doing another wave of, like, I don't know what this is, but YouTube keeps identifying certain, like, gamers by their automated system as vi supporting violent criminal organizations. Damn. It makes me afraid to play this game. I got bought for that once too. You guys may have, all you members may have gotten an email on that like a couple months ago. They bopped me for playing, uh, I was playing a mafia game. Like it was, uh, it was like another top down, like, uh, 1920s, you know, prohibition, um, you know, management game where like you, you know, you hire people to be in your mob or whatever. And like YouTube shut, shut Ladies me down for being, I was a violent criminal, guys. Thanks violent. Yeah, I immediately went to my YouTube rep, and I'm like, what the hell's going on? Like, this is still a problem on YouTube months later? Like, come on. Bi Multi-billion dollar corporation, but the auto flag on somebody... Like, I just read that a, somebody playing World of Warcraft got bopped for, like, being... Prom promoting a violent criminal organization. Like, what? What do you mean, YouTube? Like, sometimes YouTube, they're starting to do this thing now where they're scanning people's unlisted videos and private videos. 
But I, I see that's what they're doing now. YouTube notified us of this new thing that they're doing. Uh, where they're... They're... They're basically... What they're doing now is they're scanning everybody's privated and unlisted videos to make sure there's nothing fishy in there. Because YouTube has this real... Fear that people are hosting unlisted videos on YouTube, but then they're like hosting them on other websites. So YouTube's doing this big scan. But, you know creates five problems and solves one. That type of thing. I mean, on one hand, yeah, we, we certainly don't want certain criminal organizations to be on YouTube. Totally fair. Makes sense. But when, uh, you know, when somebody's just playing World of Warcraft and you send out the automated, hey, we're shutting you down email, it's like, whoa, whoa, you need to have that reviewed by a person, YouTube. Now, here's what you do, uh, big billion dollar corporation. Uh, and by the way, I'll need half your profits then for this advice. Thanks. Uh, all you need to do is before you send out the, hey, we've, uh, we've basically put a bullet in your channel, uh, before pulling the trigger on the uh, permadeath, uh, have it reviewed by somebody with a brain? Maybe? An actual human being, not the automated system? What you do is you have the system identify the potential issues, and then you have a person confirm or de deny that being an issue. That, that's all you got to do. Oh, you'd have to hire somebody and cut into your profits? Oh, well, that's fine. Just, uh, just, just pay them to do the job you should be doing. Uh. Yeah, a lot of stuff YouTube does is automated, but it's just like, it's really... Some of the things that, you know, are like permanent or like heavy-handed need to be controlled by a human. Okay, bedtime everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. But this always leads to the same conversation we always have. Do I think this game is better than Prison Architect? No, I think this is uh, a lot of a lot of people. Uh, gamers seem to do this thing where it's like, is this better than that, or is it worth it? That type of thing. I always see games as like food, and I just I want more on my plate. So though maybe you'll prefer pizza to hamburgers, I still like pizza and I like burgers. So I think these are both both games are great. Prison Architect's been around. Uh, for years since 2005 and this new game uh, seems like it could have a lot more added to it over time but you could say the same thing sorry this is Prison Tycoon Prison Architect has had quite a few DLCs and there's quite a few um, kind of story based things in that game so that one's you know a little more established because it's been around for its most recent release but this one's new and in early access so but both are good and the PA system I can't get over I love it I still love it so much Click or tap join and become a member today. Don't forget to smash join, otherwise you miss out on awesome giveaways on the Discord. See? Click or tap join and become a member today. Don't forget to smash join, otherwise you miss out on awesome giveaways on the Discord. Yeah, the Prison Architect uh, game has been around for a few years. Pr Prison Tycoon has been around since 2005 with all of its releases and such. Prison Architect has been around since like 2015-ish or something like that, so... But both the games are good. Pinto Blast Bob Ross. Pinto Blast Bob Ross. See, when you do that, then chat, chat will respond like... Chat, if we could go ahead and get up to uh, 300 likes, that'd be greatly appreciated. Thanks, guys, for clicking the like button for free to support the channel for free that you watch content for free. It's all free. Yay, free. Chad, if we can go ahead and get up to uh, 300 likes, that'd be greatly appreciated. Thanks, guys, for clicking the like button for free to support the channel for free that you watch content for free. It's all free. Yay, free. See? If you have a PA system, everyone will just do whatever you say. It's great. Chat, could I have a Baconator from Wendy's with a medium fry and a Sierra Mist? Do they have Sierra Mist or is it the Coke or Pepsi products? Chat, could I have a Baconator from Do they have Sierra Mist or is it, is it Coke or Pepsi product? 
Is it Pepsi? Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't remember. I think it's Pepsi. Pepsi owns everything. I think they even own the Air Force. Wait, what's going on here? No room assigned. Oh. Well, you need a prison cell, don't you? There you go. Wait, he's been rehabilitated. Wait, how did he not have a cell? He's been here for a while. Hmm. We need to get more money. We need more money. Wow, we got all this power, water, food. Yeah, now we just need straight up cash. Oh, that plane looks blobby. Oh well. Not a flight simulator, it's a prison tycoon game. You don't know, you just get a frosty and go home? That's all you get from Wendy's? Just a frosty? Bruh. No way. Yeah, that's good. What's up, David? Or, sorry, Daniel. How's it going, man? Daniel Ritter in chat. What's up? Good to see you here. Chat, let's spam ramen emotes for Daniel Ritter. Coming in live to the live stream. Good to have you here, Daniel. Appreciate the support. Chat, let's spam ramen emotes for Daniel Ritter. Coming in live to the live stream. Good to have you here, Daniel. Appreciate the support. Someone's going to have to sweep the basketball court. I mean, that kind of makes sense, but... Come on, how does the backboard of a basketball hoop get dirty? Come on. Like, this would be after years and years of, like, rain... And bird crap and other stuff. Come on. Uh. Yeah, Wendy's got a breakfast menu about a year ago. I was going to go, and then something happened, and then I forgot about it. This TV's never going to get clean. I'm just going to buy this TV again. There. You're loving the content and the streams? Always a good time? Oh, good. Thanks for watching. I, I just can't believe how stuff gets dirty that, like, it doesn't have that much foot traffic. And look at how filthy people are. Like, water bottle... Apple core, Good banana morning. peel. Wake up, sleepy heads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. Yeah, we could train all of our janitorial staff. It just takes money to do that. And when we train, when we promote them, that's what gives them the training, and that costs us more money. That's why, like, we're not making so much money right now because I got everybody trained up. We got ten thousand bucks. Hey, uh, watching this prison get dirtier and dirtier is just—it hurts. But we need money. Only way we're getting money is with more prisoners. Ladies and 
gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying. Wait, wait, sometime. Oh. Uh, someone's trying to escape. That is totally not cool, and I think the prison guard is definitely going to stop short of... Oh, yep, look at that. The prison guard stopped chasing us. Imagine that. Let's see if you can cheese this game out a little bit. Wait, where... of the guards themselves where would the prisoner go oh yeah yeah they always just go to some corner of the uh, prison that nobody ever sees why are some more guards yeah it's not even that big of a deal you'd think that'd be a horrible deal but it's like meh oh, well now we have a new prisoner all right, on a sign for a sociopath, and we need a... Let me just go here. There we go. What's it like in comparison to Prison Architect? Well, it's, I mean, you know, the prisons don't really vary greatly. It's kind of the same in many ways, but different, too. It kind of feels a little bit more like Two Point Hospital. If you know Two Point Hospital, just imagine if Two Point Hospital and Prison Architect had a baby, and that's Prison Tycoon under new management. Bum, bum, ba, bum, bum. Oh, we rehabilitated another prisoner. Jeez, the amount of trash is crazy. How do the walls even get dirty? Like, the door is ru Okay, clearly, clearly there needs to be some work. I think all we got to do is just have more room specializations. Like, we could probably build a room for kleptomaniacs now, so let's do that. So, therapy. Kleptomaniacs are the sensory deprivation room, 8x8. Eight eight. We should be able to fit a couple of beds in here. Kleptomania. Wait, you can only put one... Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying. Wait, wait, sometime. Oh, we can only put one sensory deprivation pod in there. No kleptomaniacs and oh that's weird like some rooms can treat multiple people at a time like the library but the sensory deprivation room only does one weird we got to get up to that prestige five though that's our main goal We're only at 68 out of 125,000 where's the electric oh yeah they have that right here shock therapy at the Tesla therapy that's for cultist disorder. We haven't seen that yet. There's also one for hacker disorder, reckless drivers, liar disorder, pyromania. Compulsive gambler needs the tabletop games therapy. I think we'll probably do tabletop games and the gardening next. I have seen some kleptomaniacs here. Oh, 
There we go. We'll hire some uh, therapy personnel very soon when we when we get more prisoners for it. Whatever they need next. All right, this guy needs a uh, sociopath, so that's regular therapy, I think. Oh wait, what does sociopath need? Sociopath is... Oh, that's for the uh, VR training, okay. Yeah, we're at like 68,000 x um... Wait, where are you going? This guy trying to escape? He's just digging a hole right there. What? I guess we're gonna have to have a more... Su Okay, we're going to have to bump up security now, because they're just going to start taking money away from us. Alright, next time we're going to do, uh, we're going to just increase security now. Fine, let's take out a juicy loan. Okay. Security. Oh, we don't really need a room. We just need cameras everywhere. Ah, okay. So now we gotta work on... Well, they seem to only be able to try to escape, like, outside. <laughs> like... Oh, we can only put the cameras indoors, though? Okay, so indoors are cameras. Outdoors are... Well, nobody's really tried to escape indoors. They always try to dig out, like, in these small corners, but it's like... That's annoying. Oh, if we make... Okay. I do like how easily it is to fit stuff in the prison. Okay, these towers are really annoying. I wish the uh, outside walls could have some sort of a... Because that would make things a lot easier, right? Like, anything by the fence and the walls with the towers should be able to be seen by guards inside these towers. I, I know it's just for looks, but it's like, they should be able to, like, see everything inside the prison. Or at least inside the, the walls of the prison, except for the buildings. And then that's what the security cameras are for. Andy Dufresne. Get busy, click and like. Click or tap join. Okay, 
no more, no more escapes. Basically, we're just exchanging money for prestige. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Ooh, this guy's really mad. Mad face emote. This guy is really angry. We gotta get him into reading books right away. There we go. Okay, that's good. Bum, bum, bum. I think we gotta keep adding stuff for prestige, really. I don't know what we, what we can do for uh, emotes. Can we get any? Can we get any emotes that'll make more more money? Into a bless emote, maybe. What is this? Cursed sarcophagus, prestige seven fifty. Wow. I need to do something to, to make us some uh, more X, XP in the prestige. I guess. Gonna have to be an X. Exterior item, outdoor item. Oh, we can have a gardening shed for three seventy-five. That's not much. Ooh, prestige. Outdoor statue for three thousand prestige. Now that's that's what we're talking about. Just throw away money for points. That's all this is. Good, we're at 7,500 out of 12. No, 75,000 out of 125,000. Wow, I forgot. That's crazy. So what, more? Maybe more indoor stuff? Ooh, a fish tank. Let's put that in the staff area. And now we have to wait for more money to come in. Oh, there we go. We got some money emotes in chat. That's good. Um. Till the day is over, we'll get some more cash tomorrow. This game's cool. Yeah, at this point, like, um, we're able to handle all the prisoners pretty well now. It seems like I'm trying to find out the things that trigger them trying to escape. Like, for example, it seems like when our cells are full, that's when we get somebody to try to, try to escape then. The worst thing about them escaping <laughs> is the money takes money away from us. We gotta be cautious about that. There's our money. It take, so we, we're paying about 5,000 in wages. 
per month. Wow, look at just how absolutely filthy things are. I can't believe that. Oh, and also our loan payment, too. All right, we're just going to have to not spend any money for a while, I guess, because we, we got that loan to pay off. Is there something I can do for loan payments? Like, can I pay that off early? Okay, we can pay off this loan. Let's do that. Hello. Good morning. Wake up, sleepyheads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. Wow, we can take out like a $285,000 loan. Well, we can make some massive prisons now, but... Like, we can, make, we can make a huge prison and make it super efficient, but that would just be far too expensive for the amount of prisoners that we're getting. I think we just got to hire more cleaning staff. And maybe more gardeners. Well, look, we have one gardener taking care of all the plants. That's not a problem. All right, we're going to hire another gardener. And then we're going to hire some more uh, cleaning staff. Because if, if we don't clean, then building is shut down. Oh, we got another angry emote. Let's see. All right, let's get you into the reading system right there. Reading rainbow. Oh, we got a lot of prisoners in the library. Dunk them in the pool. That sounds like a fantastic idea. That sounds like a fantastic idea. I wonder if we can make a pool. Only one prisoner can play basketball at a time? Well, it seems to be the only thing they can do is play basketball. Yeah, books will teach them to be angry. I want to open these other therapy rooms, but everybody else has either been rehabilitated or they want uh, rooms that are other things, I guess. Bum, 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 bum. Greetings from Hungary. What's up, Peter? Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying. At this rate, we may as well hire one maintenance staff per every item we own. Angry and alcohol. Okay. Wait, do we not have enough cells? Ooh. We might actually have to finally build more cells. Yep. I feel like I want to move these rooms... I want to move all the therapy rooms over here now. And extend our cell block. Oh, but that's going to take too much money. Mm. I need to put... Um, I'd prefer all the cells to be in this main section here. Because it's where the showers are, it's where the infirmary is, where our uh, canteen is as well. Hmm.
We don't get a lot of money back. We can't really move rooms, and we don't get a lot of money back for, like, selling them either, so it's... Selling them. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited to see how this game develops, too, after updates and community feedback and stuff. Like, it's not a perfect game by any means, but... It's definitely got all the base stuff here that... I mean, I think... 75% of what I'd want is here. I want to see, like, a story mode. And maybe they'll add some updates over the next uh, year. Yeah, there is an option to stop prisoner intake, yeah. In fact, we want more prisoners, but... I feel like if this guy hangs out for a little bit, by this... Very sh shortly, we'll have somebody go to parole. That guy can hang out there for a while. That's just a holding cell, so we'll just keep him there for a bit. Wait, he's not getting off the bus. Oh, so that... Wait, so only one prisoner can go in there at a time? Really? Wow, that's uh, annoying. Anybody ready for parole? the game and all the sounds t turned down. What, what happened? Like, the sound just, like, halved itself. Okay, we better name our new prison. Yep, perfect. Let's load. Wait, I, I don't understand. What, what is this room this prisoner's in with all the apple cores, banana peels, and like the room being caked in just like dirt? Hello. Good morning. Wake up, sleepy heads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. Okay, we, oh, oh, wait a minute. The prisoner cell sh does have a shared thing. More more than one should be able to go in there. Hmm. That's interesting. Wow, everything's caked in dirt. Uh, is it me or does the guy sound like Raptor on the PA? Really? That doesn't sound anything like me.
time, everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. Do prisons have Yelp reviews? Chat, do you know? That would be interesting. Bum, bum. Now we just gotta sit back and wait for some more money to roll in. new day wow uh, it seems like the prison could only be one level but you can expand it quite a lot there's a lot of territory for us to buy and, like s spread out the prison and okay, now we can put some people on parole ah, there we go the prison was getting awfully full Okay, now we got some space. Oh, we have to wait for them to leave. Okay. All right, we granted some parole. Once those cells are clear, we'll be good. September 1986, time to go to school, winky face. Tan, you were teaching back then before you retired? Got him. Oh, that money, though. Damn. Oh, even more cash. Oh, each parolee gives us cash. Like, consecutively, not all at once. Uh, loans. All right, let's pay back. Just pay off our Discover card. There we go. All right, there we go. I can't believe it. These desks still have to be cleaned. That drives me nuts. Oh, well. I mean, to be honest, chat, you're not really bothered too much by a flashing, continuous symbol and outline that's totally triggering in every way, are you? Look at that. The sconces in half. What? What? It's just like red alert. I don't know why the staff doesn't Hello. prioritize that stuff. Good morning, wake up, sleepy heads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. All right, let's see. Get you guys in your new cells now that the parolees are gone. You're going over to painting, and you're going to we'll put you in the painting room too. Bum 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 bum. Well, now we have $36,000, but I don't see much more need to add on to the, uh... I don't see much need to add on to, like, all the... Therapy... Therapy rooms yet. I, I could see a need for more cells, but... Hmm. I guess we could put some cells down here. If we need to. What would increase? Oh, you know we could we could uh, make more prisoner. Um, yeah, we could improve their cells, and that would increase our prestige a bit. Wow, two twenty. Oh, they're. Oh, 
Well, that's actually quite a bit of prestige. Let's let's increase the quality of the cells. Buy a bunch of radios and see how that goes. I don't know what radio and table you're buying for $900, but wow. I feel like you could go on Amazon and... No. I could just pay... I could pay one of these, like, maintenance people $900 to make, like, a bunch of tables for the prison. You want a teddy bear? Yeah, I know, same. Okay, well this will increase our prestige a lot. Then we'll start putting in um, bathroom sinks, too. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. I put water fountains in their cells too. Ooh, that increases it by 112. They love water. It's like they need it to live or something. It's crazy. You're joining from Latvia? Well, thanks for watching. Always good to see everybody from around the world watching. Yeah, there's no way around it. We're going to have to make some more cells. Maybe if we put water fountains in their cells, they'll leave. Uh, they'll stop leaving their cell. The Netherlands is in chat? Oh, good. We'll have somebody to do maintenance on the windmill. Perfect. That's perfect. These cells also need water fountains, but I'm going to save our money for new cells, and we'll come back to those later, because I'm going to need new ones. We need a new cell block down here. And this guy has alcoholism and anger problems. That seems to be the two major issues here. Every time we need a new cell, we'll just build it down there. And I think we're going to try to save some money for the 
Wait, we don't have any loan payments anymore, do we? Uh, we need to keep at least like $5,000 though for staff wages. Let's make like two more rooms. Uh, what's a PA system? Uh, it's named after uh, PA Baracus uh, from 18. He pities the fool who doesn't click or tap like. No, PA system is a public announcement. It's ba This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. If you're hearing this, well, this is a test. I. I just literally explained it. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. If you're hearing this, well, this is a test. I, I just literally explained it. Yep. Yep. I get nervous putting more stuff in these cells, though. It means one more thing to have to be cleaned. Wait, can we put a wardrobe outside the cells? In any other room? Oh, if we uh, grant one more parole, we get $7,000. Damn. And one more alcoholic rehab, and we've got ourselves another goal knocked out. We haven't had any uh, hackers or anything yet. I think the game starts you out pretty easy and then gets more complicated as time goes on. Yeah, prisoners should be cleaning their own space. I agree. I agree. Okay, so we got room for three more prisoners. A little overflow. And we got about 5,000 bucks, and I don't want to spend any more of that. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Uh, can we get some Barry Manilow in the system? Uh, let's see. Uh, let's try. I'm going to try something here. Hold on. Um, let's try this. That's good. It works. Well, this uh, stream is now demonetized, isn't it? I think we were at 9 seconds and 59.59. So the whole channel is getting shut down now. Okay, well, let's speed up time while we wait. Imagine that, though. Imagine if this stream was 24 hours long. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. 
Prisoner, welcome to prison. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying. Quite some the biggest BS on Earth is if I did a 24-hour charity stream and a copyrighted song played longer than nine seconds, the RIAA and whoever had the copyright of that song would hold 24 hours of work because of nine seconds of basically background noise. Could you imagine that? That literally is like being three seconds late to work and your your employer being like, well, you still have to work an entire eight hours and we're going to go ahead and keep the eight hours of uh, your shift, but you still have to work. Imagine that. Imagine that. That sounds like a good business plan. Just sue everybody in a tornado. Yeah, wow. Wow! Tell us more, YouTuber. Wow! Tell us more, YouTuber. <laughs> no. No. Bum, 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 bum. Demonetized is greater than demoralized. True. Wow, let's speed up time. Yeah, I don't think there's a way to manage staff priority. Like, it, it does list staff. Okay, bedtime, everybody. But, Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. Well, actually, okay, so there's stuff coming soon to the game. Like, for example, on the left side here, you see percentage of employees' work shift dedicated to rest. Like, we can make, uh... I think there's some things that if we try to change it, it tells us it's still in early access. So they're working on a few of those things. Like, like there's one here. Give therapists the ability to assign therapies automatically. If you try to switch that to yes, it'll say this feature is in development and will be added during the early access phase. So. Bum, 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 bum. Percentage of employees work shift dedicated to rest. Acceptable, generous, crazy, or Amazon. We'll send it to Amazon. Okay. No rest, only work. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's great. Everyone we released on parole committed a crime again. Awesome. Which gives us barely any money to spend. Hello. Good morning. Wake up, sleepyheads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it another day in prison. Uh, when are they going to come out with a Be the President of the United States simulator? I think there actually is a game out called, like, I Am Your President or something like that. There's plenty of, like, political simulators out there. Uh, ooh. Nope. I feel like we're stunlocked now with money. Like, I, I need more cash, but... Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Oh, here we go. Now we're starting to get reckless drivers and stuff. Okay. Oh, wait. There's no... Uh... Oh, no. There's a therapist in there. Anger and alcoholism. Okay. Put you into therapy as well. Sociopath. What is a sociopath, chat? 
What's is there like a definition? Is it, it does it say what that is? Democracy Four is probably the most polished at the moment. Yeah, I, yeah. There's like there's plenty of those games. I guess the most interesting ones are like where you have to run for president and then do policies and such. That seems kind of interesting. But there's a lot of them that are like uh, uh, there's like um, there's ones where where you have to go to war. In modern times, I, I don't know. There, there's plenty of them. A person with personality disorder manifesting itself in extreme antisocial attitudes and behavior and lack of conscience. Oh, are they violent? Like, what, what would be wrong with that? Uh, Tropico? Yeah, I guess that Tropico's a political simulator. I'm thinking of, like, grand strategy games, though. But... People with ASPD can't understand others' feelings. The break rules, or... Oh, okay. So they're like... They're difficult for society. Okay. Sociopaths would probably be like the people who go to a grocery store... And... Pull out one of the carts at the grocery store. And they go throughout the store, and they put in cans of beans, and... Spaghetti and a couple of things of hamburger and cereal and coffee and milk. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome Cheese, to prison. Thanks eggs, for coming. And bread. Remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. And they walk around the grocery store, and while they're in the store, they walk about a mile and a half, two miles. And they go to the checkout, and they finish paying for all their food, and they put all their food into bags. They put them back into the cart. And they push the cart out of the store. And they go back to their big SUV or whatever. And then they push it to their car and they start loading their car up with all the bags of groceries. But then somewhere between bringing that cart from the car to the cart corral where the employee can then take it from a collected area and bring it back into the store, suddenly their sociopath narcissism kicks in and Tammy or Beth or Roger or Tom or Steve or Dave or perhaps CJ or Jerry Kirchhoff in chat, maybe has a thought of, wait, how does bringing this cart back to the cart corral benefit me? What's in it for me? And the cart just sits there, and that pattern is repeated across the entirety of the planet 24-7, day and night. That thought spreads its poison, hour after hour, day after day, until the entire world is brought to its knees. I think that's literally the story of Mad Max, is that people just stop bringing their shopping carts in and boom, Mad Max. It's pretty much, pretty much what happened. Bum, bum, bum. Yep, Space Haven videos are on the channel. Make sure you check it out. Space Haven's a good game. Bum, bum. Yeah, that that is the thing that drives me the, the most nuts, is the what's in... Why should I do this for other people? What's in it for me? No can do, gotta go. The uh, the stepping up to do what you kind of entered into in a social contract with everyone else by doing something. You just put, hey, when you're done, you know, at, at the Wendy's and you're in the dining room, just push your chair in when you're done. Bring your uh, tray over to the garbage can. Put all the stuff in there and put the tray on top. Bring your cart back. Hold the door for others, that type of thing. In our current scenario, maybe some things are a little understandable. Maybe you don't want to get close to people for certain reasons. That's fine. But the cart is where we need to start. The cart is where we need to start. That's... I'm going to go play Democracy 4 and, like, 
Start building super mega... Ma I don't want super max. I want super mega max prisons. For people who don't put their card in. And I see a lot of people leaving the stream, which is good, because that means they're going grocery shopping, because they're hungry from all those emotes. And they know damn well to use their blinker before they signal into the grocery store. And they'll be more than excited to return that card back to the car corral. <laughs> yeah, carts and blinkers, yeah. Yeah, the, the non-use of the... Oh, uh-oh, someone's not using their blinker. Where do we have someone trying to escape? Oh, right here. Security, what are you doing? Why go out the door? Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying. Wait, wait, sometime. So, th four guards stacking up here next to the fence. Within, like, line of sight of this hole being dug by a prisoner. Dumb. Bum, 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 bum. Uh, someone's trying to escape. That is totally not cool, and I bet the prison guard is definitely going to stop short of... Oh, yep, look at that. The prison guard stopped chasing him. Imagine that. Yeah, they either catch him right away, or somehow they just, they're just they the greatest criminal in the world where they can just dig out in two seconds. Crazy. <laughs> Alright, let's see. We need to add a outdoor security tower, then. This is the only thing we can do right now, is just basically build these towers to stop them. Yeah, that's the only way it's going to work. Bum 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 bum. Yeah, just as a reminder, the Steam Summer Sale is coming to an end. I got a list of ten recommendations for my sale, by the way. Oh, or for sale that I, I would recommend on Steam. Uh, Medieval Dynasty, in no particular order, by the way, but Medieval Dynasty, City Skylines, okay, uh, Euro Thank Truck Simulator. Uh, American Truck Simulator, Park Attack, Train Sim World 2, Astroneer, Two Point Hospital, Valheim, and Transport Fever. Just like perfect games that never, they don't really have ends to them. You can kind of build with all those games for a very, very long time. And there's like billions and billions of DLCs and or mods for them. Like Farming Simulator and uh, Euro Truck and uh, City Skylines have so many community made mods. It's ridiculous. Like it, it, It's almost like you pay almost like 25 cents per each mod or uh, like, the, like um, some, some pretty major mods that you can download for free. You just got to pay like the, the initial paywall. Like here, I'm going to tab out right now. And I'm going to go look at Steam and see how much all of City Skylines costs. Let's see. A bus has just arrived. Whoa, calm down. So City Skylines and all DLCs are... Let's see. $122.71. for everything. Most of which I would say, well, most of the stuff listed here is uh, music packs for like two or three bucks. So it's probably, if you wanted to get City Skylines and all the DLCs, it's probably like $80.
No, less than that. Like, oh, here it is. Yeah. Oh, okay. Here's the collection bundle. Forty-four dollars. That's what you want to get. The City Skylines collection. That's the game and all the DLCs. Forty-four dollars. That is. <laughs> so forty-four dollars divided by the Move It mod. Um, all the all the little custom buildings and stuff that are in there. There's like tons of mods. It's like it's like two two dollars per awesome mod. Crazy. And they're constantly updated by the by the uh, the community. Love you love No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky is great. I love those space games because I I really like to take my time in space games. Everybody like does wind sprints across the map all the time and it's so fast, but. In like Star Citizen, No Man's Sky, Elite Dangerous, I just like to go slow and just kind of chill. I want to go back and try Elite Dangerous, um, the new DLC on that one. It would, they, we had a sponsored stream with them uh, about a month or so ago, and it was just like, I really wanted to enjoy it, but it was just annoying. But I'll, I'll be patient and try it again soon. I hope they fixed all the little little bugs and stuff. Well, some of them weren't little. They were some pretty major bugs, but I had some issues with the game. Alex didn't, so I guess it was based on... It was just based on each person's computer. Why are we stun-locked into submission with the desk never being clean? It just doesn't seem like there's a way for staff to be prioritized to do their job. Other than hiring more staff... You gotta hire one staff member per item. You have a kid now? You have to spend time with him? You can't spend money on games now? Well, you you could, because a lot of these games don't, you know, it, you don't necessarily have to be fully committed to these games all the time. You know, you can go play City Skylines for an hour and then just sell it. <laughs> Wait, somebody needed medical attention? Okay. You can always restart in City Skylines, and some of those games you can always uh, pick up where you left off anytime, and you don't have to put a ton of time into them. But of course, you buy a game, you want to play a game. That makes sense. Hello, good morning, wake up, sleepy heads. We have a big day of prison ahead of us. Congratulations to all of you for making it. Ba -bum, bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. Is that really you in the game, or did you record this yourself? Uh, both, technically. Uh, one's in chat. One's in chat. One's in chat. One's in chat. Oh, line for the drinking phone. These cells look really nice, though. What do we have for prestige? We just basically need to get nothing but prestige now. Damn, we still need about 40,000. Well, more than that. <laughs> I don't know the best way to get prestige other than decorating the cells. way to sort by a prestigious item? I guess we could put in more 750 for 3,000? Meh. Eh, whatever. Wait, this item has to go in the hallway? Okay, I guess we'll just we'll just put the sarcophagus there for no reason. Okay. Wow. So, oh, that plant's. Ooh. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming, and remember, you'll also be staying. 
wait some time. I don't think I've ever seen a single prisoner in this room. Well, at least there's lots to decorate, though. That's cool. What's up, Michael? How you doing, dude? Welcome on back. Good to have you here. We'll finally add the drinking fountains. I guess we'll just have to decorate every hallway then. Let's get to building. We got a lot to build. Let's do it, chat. Yeah. Wait a minute. You can put a vending machine in the cell? Oh, no. Okay. All right, then let's do some more benches in the hallways. nice. Yeah, I know. It's certain. It really does look like a hotel. It's Prisoner Hotel is really what it is. It's two games in one. A hotel tycoon and a prison tycoon. It's two for ones. Looks good, though. Except for everything being completely filthy. I can't believe how this table's never been cleaned. I've requested the cleaning of this table multiple times. new prisoner. Let's get you into a cell. And into alcohol treatment right away. Oh boy. You just pulled the trigger on a 3D printer? Oh cool. I've always, uh, I've known a few people to have like 3D printers and stuff. For myself, I, I'd never know what to print. I'd buy that and then I would just be like, just, I would just stare at it and be like, well, that's cool. But I'd never use it. Like, I wouldn't know what to create, you know? Well, 
so in this prison, it's people who kind of have more like, um, more like mental illnesses of like, or dependency issues like alcoholism or sociopaths or whatever. So it, it's really more like a kind of a rehab facility or tr a treatment center, which is good. Like some, some things can be, some things can be worked on and improved and sobriety is a thing and a lot of those things are very important to get people off of dependency of certain things and to be able to be independent and uh, work with society. Not like you need life in prison because you uh, stole something. Like there's kleptomaniacs here, but that's the thing is that the issue needs to be addressed. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite late sometime. All right. Bum, 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 bum. Man, I can't get over how the hologram has to be dusted down. You went back to Two Point Hospital after watching me play this? I'm going to play that again. When we get close to Two Point Campus coming out, we're going to play some Two Point Hospital. That game is just... Organization in that game is too fun, like decorating and stuff. This game actually allows you to be a little bit more decorative than that game, even. Just a little bit more. It's nice. It, it's really nice to be able to make rooms and then decorate, and then decoration have, like, a, a reason. It's the same in Planet Coaster and Park Architect and Planet Zoo, is that those games, when you build decorations, they are meaningful. Like, in Planet Zoo, if you put down information kiosks, people actually go there to learn stuff. Like, there's a reason to do it. Kind of cool. Well, it looks like our jail cells are going to be filled up again. So. We are out of money, so let's wait until the end of the day. Let's see, what is that? Okay, good. Good. A prison for a better future? Yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I don't I don't think you can do copy and paste in this either. It's like when you click on a cell, I, I don't see any way to actually do that. I've been looking for it, like there's a way to edit and sell, but not a way to copy. It would be nice if you could save a blueprint. That way you could add a few extra things to a prison cell and then copy it elsewhere. Be helpful. Okay, we got an anger. We got a mad face emote here. Wait till the end of day. Okay, bedtime, everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. Okay, we're out of food. We gotta make some more. That makes 12 food per hour. Ooh, the nicer fridge makes... Or the... Oh, the nicer stoves actually make more food. Good. I'll work on that tomorrow. Nobody should be eating, by the way. Alright, tomorrow we're going to upgrade our kitchen. You wonder if my, uh... My hair is made from a 3D printer. It's, it's made from something. Oh, 
Oh, is it snowing? Oh, I didn't know it could snow in the prison. At least not in this map. Cool. All right, so weather effects are actually a thing. That's cool. All right, let's fix this kitchen a little bit. So let's get rid of the old stoves. makes plus 30 an hour. Wow. We're going to have a gourmet prison. And the cooks have been working real hard, so... Is that a cauldron? That's on cauldron for... Uh, what's up, Rishi? How you doing? And hello there, Discord23. Good to see you. Hi, chat. Hello. Hello, and welcome to the live stream. Good to see you here. Chat's almost up to 400 likes. Greatly appreciate your support. Wait, something's missing from the kitchen? Wait, what's missing? Required object missing. Wait, they can't use the... They can't use the super expensive stoves? Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to oh. prison. Thanks for coming in. Remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. I see. The uh, staff need to have a promotion to be able to use it. Okay. Let's see if that works. Allows cooks to work, yet none of the cooks are actually working. What the hell? That could be another issue to work on. Wait, what, what would be the requirement for them to be able to work at that? I mean, it's a, st it's a stove. They should be able to work there. Cooking stove. They should be able to cook at any of these things. Three per hour. Five per hour. Wow, that's... That's dumb. Oh wait, now wait, now somebody's using the cooktop? Okay. Well don't go use those, use the better ones. Yep, look at that. The prison guard stopped chasing. Imagine that. 
Oh good, they got him. Yeah, I promoted a few people to three star. But they weren't using the kitchen right away. But that seems to be fixed now. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying. Wait, wait, sometime. Yeah, we'll make sure we have all of our kitchen staff at level three. I do find that kind of cool how, like, to use the better items, you do have to, like, train your staff better, too. That, that seems fair. At least in the cooking department, that makes sense. Oh, wait a minute. Now it says it doesn't ever... So they can use the better stoves, but it doesn't... It needs the... Okay, that, that seems to be a glitch. It wants the... In order for it to function, it has to find that there's a low-level stove. But people should still be able to use the high-level cooktop. I don't know. They need the first one to use the more advanced one. Yeah, that seems like a weird thing, though. That means, like, if I'm going to make a kitchen... <laughs> that's like saying, oh, in order for you to drive your car, you still have to have a bike in your garage. That's like, well, driving a car requires a license, and you have to... You travel at higher speed. Yeah, but you can't, you can't use your car without a bike. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's, like, weird. Uh, one of those weird video game things. Wait, this person's a three-star. Oh, they had to kind of like figure their way out to walk over to the kitchen. What the hell? I don't know. Thank you, chat, for getting to 400 likes. Although, 500 will be completely unachievable. I know it. It's true. Thank you, chat, for getting to 400 likes. Although, 500 will be... Completely unachievable. I know it. It's true. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Nobody even comes to the visitor room anyway. We're supposed to have a visitor room. I've never seen anybody come visit. Oh, the prisoners just come in here to sit down. Also, really? A TV's not going to work unless it's... Like, is the screen of the TV so dusty that you can't make out the picture behind it? Like, there's no way. There's no way. Like, what happened in here? <laughs> is this house flipper? It's become like House Flipper. It's Prison Flipper. Like, from Raptor to Viewer. Hi there. Uh, my uh, game room thing for Dungeons and Dragons is super filthy. Could you reclaim it? Those prisoners are awfully messy when they play Dungeons and Dragons. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying. Wait, wait, sometime. Oh, we got another prisoner. Man, everybody with the anger and the alcohol issues. Jeez. Uh, thought we had another cell. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy.
Wait, no, not a toilet. Oh, we could put radios in these rooms. And we're out of money. Alright, looks like we're getting the food thing back under control. Wow, we've made a lot of progress, though, in getting a lot of prisoners released. What are our grant goals now? Okay, bedtime, everybody. Thank you very much for a lovely day in our lovely prison. Remember to give us a five-star review on Yelp when you get home. Thanks. Okay, so if we reach prestige level five, that'll also unlock a lot of new goals for us. Some things will happen in time, like one of these is to... One goal is to cure ten prisoners, so they have to get sick first before we can cure them. We got a long way to go. But some things will just have to happen at random. add some more uh, radios too to get that prestige up. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. There's still three more. Nope. A little bit longer on that one. Uh, do you have to set visiting hours? Uh, they're set automatically, but I don't think there's an animation for people to come in. Uh, visiting hours are from 17 to 20, but... Prisoners, like, go in there, but... That's not, not great. Very short time. I wish there was also a, like a, a easier way to promote everybody. Like at this point, I have so much money that I want to put it back into like my, um, my cleaning staff. But in order to upgrade my cleaning staff, it's like you gotta you get everybody to level three. I'd have to like take thirty people. Every time you click once, it like closes the menu, so you, and then you gotta find the person again. So like updating, going here, and then finding who I had to up, like I can't tell who's what level, it's, uh, it's a nightmare. Nightmare. I wish I could just full-time assign people to clean each room though. I just have somebody with a just constantly dusting. Wow, look at that. We made a ton of food now. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Alright, another sociopath. Let's go over here. Uh oh yeah, this one. Yeah, no more staff at this point. I think I gotta upgrade everybody, but to do that, it's so hard. It's annoying. Oh well. Bum, bum, ba, bum, ba, bum.
Now we can put some water fountain. Little drinking fountains in here too. There we go. Good. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new prisoner. Welcome to prison. Thanks for coming. And remember, you'll also be staying quite some time. Wait a minute. Top 10 hours of watching the stream. Number one, Baltimore's with 882 hours. Tan with 741. Step it up, Tan. Uh, Samuel with 587, Pilot Pro with 509, Indrid with 413. What? How the hell am I in sixth place? I'm here every day. I own the place. <laughs> I only have 372 hours of watch time of my own streams. What? Jerry with three, uh, 363, Holly with 338, Patrick Starr with 310, and Trous with 299.25. Wow. Wow. I need to step up. Wow. That's got to be broken then. Like, how does that work? It's probably because usually when, I, when I'm watching the chat, there's a way where I can watch my own stream and have the chat on, and I usually just pause the stream because I can see it over on the other monitor. So I can make sure everything's going okay. How weird. Do I think real prisoners would enjoy this game? I'm sure there'll be some WoWa prison, cha you know, there, there's kind of some weird channels out there that'll do these things where they have like a, a real Navy SEAL reviews a game about Navy SEALs or whatever. There's always these channels where they, they show like a prisoner, a prison cooking video and they'll comment on whether or not it's realistic or whatever. I imagine like that being your profession though like you go to prison and then when you get out you just review any game that has a prison in it you get to go in there and say whether or not it's realistic or accurate <laughs> like any game that features a prison scene you can comment on whether or not that's accurate like no it's not really like that like oh, okay True. Bum, bum, bum. You have five minutes of watch time? No, you don't. You have more than that. You're here all the time. Most of you are here quite often. Let's have a let's have a one in chat if it's your first time watching. And a two in chat if you've been to our live streams before. One if you're new, and two if you're here often. Curious to know. I'm just curious. What's up, Michael? And Lead Nor, how you doing? Welcome to our stream. February 1987. That takes some of you back. Back to February of 87. Is that the February of 87? What? Ah. <sighs> 
What's up, Ronald Lloyd? Good to see you. All right, well, we got $33,000 now in the bank. Uh, we got some extra space for prisoners. At this point, like, the only thing we need to do is just wait for therapy. Like, at this point, it's just a waiting simulator. It's like, we're only at the mercy of how often prisoners come in. So it's like, we at this rate, we're getting like two or three a month. We got a new one here. We could, we could make more rooms, but I think we just need to work on prestige. We could unlock more better equipment. Uh, let's see. Now we still need about 30,000 uh, XP. I don't know where that's going to come from. Oh, the, the bot in chat tells you how many hours you have. Some people probably have more before we started using that bot, but it's been over a year. But Baltimore's probably has, like, way more hours than that. Uh, I used to watch your YouTube for Jurassic World Evolution 2. Am I excited? Oh, am I excited for... I don't know if I could say uh, anything, but... Let's just say, uh, yeah, that Jurassic World 2 is looking pretty cool. It'd be super awesome if... something related to that game was to happen on this channel soon. That's about all, all I could say. If, if there was anything to say about it, that's all I could say. Actually, they sent me something really cool in the mail. They sent me like a... Hello. They sent me Good cookies morning. in the mail. Hypothetically speaking, yeah. No, yeah, they sent me something really cool in the mail. You'll have to uh, check out my... I think I posted it on Twitter and in our Discord. They sent me some cookies and... They were like some... Like fossil cookies that they sprinkled like... Broken... Uh, uh, biscuits on top of and then like you could go through with a little brush and like brush off the, the other cookies. I think they were... I, I think I could eat them, but... At this point they've probably gone stale and too... I'd, I'd feel bad eating something so so perfect and beautiful like me all right well there we go folks that's another day of uh, prison tycoon under new management we'll uh, come on back tomorrow for some more streams we'll, on wednesday we got some big streams uh transport tycoon 2 has a big summer update as they're calling it and also there's a new train simulator dlc out which looks awesome we get to haul coal out in the american west brother amen We'll come on back tomorrow for some more streams. I'll figure out what we're going to be streaming. I'll have some more videos for you guys tomorrow. And we've entered kind of our, like, chill summer. Uh, pretty much from now until, like, September. Not too many big games coming out. I'll cover any big ones that do. But for the most part, everybody's on vacation and things are more chill here on, on YouTube. So, um, But anyway, thanks for subbing. Thanks for all the big O Super Chats. Welcome to the new members. We'll have some more giveaways this week. Uh, especially this weekend, too, for uh, Call to Arms. And uh, Gates of Hell... Wait, what is it called? Call to Arms, Gates of Hell, Ostfront. I know. That's a word. It's a lot of words. But anyway, more giveaways and such on the Discord. Just be active on there. Come say hi in the general chat. Members will come chat with you too. Members, never be afraid to chat with everybody in our general chat too. A lot of people there just wanted to say, uh, say hi and hang out too. So if you guys want to play any games or whatnot, we got a wonderful Discord for you guys to get uh, acquainted with each other and you want to host a server or play some games or whatever just go in there and chat i will see you guys soon thanks for hanging out have a good afternoon good evening and good night everyone see you next time goodbye ladies and gentlemen we have a new prisoner welcome to prison thanks for coming and remember you'll also be staying quite some time